Fisher Gang, up, Fisher Family up? here. We back with another video for y'all. Your boy Justin. Cool boy Mason. Got me Cassis here. It's my girl. And hey, today we're coming back with another challenge. challenge. So a few of y'all was in the DMs and in the comment section asking us to do a Never Have I Ever challenge. So today we're going to bring you that video. Yeah, so we're excited guys because this is an opportunity for us to learn more about each other and the, for the kids to learn more about us and the things that we did when we were younger. So this is going to be fun neat. So yeah, y'all need to tell us some things that y'all haven't told us. We got to learn some, we're going to learn some new secrets. <laughs> I think we got some good questions lined up. Uh, y'all had actually gave us some ideas on questions and some things that y'all wanted to know. So some of those questions are going to be in here. So make sure y'all watch this video, like it, subscribe, and hopefully we pick your question. All right. So you want to uh, start off? Yes. No chicken. Uh, everybody likes chicken. All right, guys, we're ready. All right, first question is, never have I ever lied to my parents. Is it cheating if you don't get caught? Oh, the kids are yeah. doing a good job. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I didn't even try to cheat. Okay, good. Hey, that's, that's good. Not that's good. Long, long time ago, those days are way behind us, but we learned our lesson, kids. I wouldn't cheat if the test was so hard. Like, I don't understand why the teachers got to make these tests so damn, damn hard. Like. <laughs> No, I'm glad the kids haven't cheated that. You guys are good. This is a good job. All right, next question. Never have I ever went an entire day without brushing my teeth. Mark, you have not. You have not? No, not an entire day without brushing my teeth. Sometimes, sometimes it's just you don't have good hygiene out there. So that's just how it is sometimes. So, oh, all right, you get a pass. Remember when we went on the vacation? Which like the driving uh -huh. all the way to Florida? Uh -huh. You did, we stopped at the hotel. Yeah, but Sunday, you never got to. Remember? Oh. Sunday? No. What? We stopped every, stop every morning. You guys brush your teeth every day. The job? You just didn't brush your teeth today. You probably did. That's what you Micah has them all the time. I'm scared of zombies, 
also Slenderman, also um, Shy Guy too. Yeah, are you scared of them? Yeah, Micah always has nightmares. We always have to go in and do what with you? Check up. No, and then when he said that, babysit him. And pray, we pray with you, make you pray, say your prayers. Dad, and sometimes get a bed. Micah has the worst nightmares out of everybody, so. That's okay though, because I have them too sometimes, and I'm an adult, so. When I was a kid, I used to have really bad night terrors. I used to wake up in my mom. Yeah, night terrors is even worse than a nightmare. I used to wake up in the middle of the night and my, I would wake up with my mom holding me, shaking me. I would go crying. She said my eyes was open and I would run around the house. I would run around the house. I was asleep screaming. Someone was chasing me. So. Uh oh, what is a demonic? Bruh. Holly, let me pray, pray that out of you. Touch me like that again. I was laying hands on you. No. Where were you? So, once upon a time. Once upon a time. Let them know when. Let them know, because they want to know too. When did you steal this candy? Once upon a time. I was very scared. Alright, speak up so they can hear you. Once upon a time. Let me have a reason for you today. Grab the back. Went to my bedroom. Ate a thousand pieces of candy. Put it back. Empty. And he still got energy from that day two years ago, as you can see, two, three years ago when I rolled this, because a thousand pieces. We threw, oh yeah, we threw away like a big bag full of your Halloween, you guys' Halloween candy. So, you didn't have a thousand pieces of candy, it's gone now. <laughs> I'm scared. Alright, alright, next question. Never have I ever ate boogers. You've never eaten boogers? No. Why would you eat them? Don't start. It's a bad habit. My name is Simon. You have eaten I think when I was little, I used to eat all kinds of weird stuff. So you would be at me? I, what? I probably. Ugh. Ugh. I ate all kinds of weird stuff. So yeah, that's when I was little. You, Why? Micah. Ew, yeah, Micah's a pig in his nose now. When did you eat boogers? Okay. This was not a long time ago. No, we made these boogers. Oh, yeah. This is five minutes ago. Okay. I was eating boogers all along. All oh, along? Oh. I, I was eating the boogers all along. Alright. This is getting gross. Let's get to the next question. Alright, alright. Alright. Well, this is the funny part. Yes. Oh, shit. That's gross. Alright. Never have I ever. Hit somebody at school. <laughs> yup. Nope. Mikey, you lying. You have <laughs> uh, So we got what what How happened? Have you not? <laughs> How did that happen? Uh I have accidentally hit somebody okay. after half day and then the other half I have it. You hit someone for half a day and the other half you get it? That, no, that means you have. Put this one down. That means you have. <laughs> Michael, when did you hit somebody? Do you remember? You don't remember? Did you hit Mason's friend? You kicked him. <laughs> <laughs> you, you apologize you though, right? So yeah, so, so uh, we won't talk about my hitting. A couple of fights when we were growing up. Uh, I don't think you can fight. You probably got beat up. Actually, I did not get beat up. So, if you wanna... Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, you got the hoop earrings? She can fight. I, know. I didn't get beat up. And it was in high school. And uh, Don't try to fight a girl that wears hoop earrings. Listen, don't do it. Just don't do it. Don't try to fight, period. Okay? And even don't try to fight me. Okay, no one's gonna try to I'm the master of the Lord. Oh, the master of the Lord? I don't think the Lord is too kind to that. Alright guys, next question. Never have I ever 
Whitaker lied about being sick to miss school. <laughs> what? You just did like two weeks ago. Yeah. I you know you haven't. Mike has not missed a day of school this year so far. And Mason, was it a lie or was it a little trick? When you threw up, a little trick. A little trick. Remember when you threw up at school? And then we, we had a computer and watch you watched. You threw up at school because you were coughing so much. That's what made you throw up. You were actually sick. And then, then you came home and you was running around playing. While and watching. Court, playing video games, watching TV, Netflix. Come on, man. Talk about some, can I have a milkshake? <laughs> all right. See? Well, I've, I've done it. So we all done it, except Micah. Micah's the good one. All right, guys. Next question. Never have I ever stepped the dog poop. Uh, Ew! Hey, Wait. when I when I was I don't know if you have second dog poop honestly. When I was when I was growing up, my dad I was the designated poop Picker. super. We had two. We had a big dog. He was a German Shepherd Husky mix, and we had another dog, another smaller dog. But anyways, they both pooped all in the backyard, and I had to clean it up. We had a little. Pooper scooper that would pick it up, ply, that thing broke. So then I had to go out there with a little shovel and like shovel up all the poop. I literally had to do that. So I was always stepping in poop because they poop so much. And sometimes I'd be picking poop up, I don't see the other turd. <laughs> so I don't even know. But hey, I don't have, I don't have any, I don't have any dogs right now. So I don't gotta worry about that. If I do step in poop, it ain't, it ain't, it's somebody's, it ain't my fault. We're gonna, we're gonna have to handle that if that happens. If I step in someone else's dog's poop, we're gonna have to. When did you step in poop? Like you said you have. Okay. Oh, I'll tell you. So, when I was a child. Okay. And walk, walk, walking. I didn't see any poop, but I stepped and squashed the poop. <laughs> and then I just run, run, run. To me, that I. And a squash of poop. Squash. A squash of poop. <laughs> Alright, so we sweep, we, we, we. And then my story is. I don't even remember. Walk, walk, walk. walk, 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 walk. Alright, next question. Next question. Never have I ever sat. Oh, another poop one, guys. Never have I ever sat on a public bathroom to poop. This is embarrassing for me. Listen, it was an emergency situation. Have you, have you ever? Micah, put the other one up because you just pooped at oh you just God. pooped at the restaurant and you pooped at the rest stop. Put the other one up. Oh, you yeah. did he poop at Benihana? What he pooped at Benihana's, yeah. Well, put that up. Know? Put that up. <laughs> put that up. Y'all always pooped at Benihana's. Hey, but listen, li listen, y'all. Life hack. If you have to, if it's an emergency and you can't hold it for 10, 15 minutes to get home, if you cannot hold it and you have to absolutely go public. I do not advise using public restroom, but if you absolutely have to, you have to pull up. First of all, you get a bunch of toilet paper, you wipe the seat off. Even if there's nothing on it, you wipe it off just to wipe it. Then you gotta put the toilet paper in the toilet so that it don't splash up and hit you when you poop it. <laughs> then you take more toilet paper off and you gotta layer up the seat with toilet paper so you got a nice little padding to sit on. And if you want to be real extra, just hover above the toilet seat just a little bit so you don't need to touch the toilet paper. Oh my gosh. That's it. Life hack. Life hack. It's important. She's saying it's a life hack. It's if it's an emergency situation, you have to do what you have to do. They didn't ask about that. All right, guys. We're winding down to the last couple of questions. Okay. Never have I ever gotten a bad grade on my report card. Yeah. I had to I had to drop a couple classes when I was in college. I had to drop a couple classes, so definitely got some bad grades. Alright, so Micah, <laughs> I see your report card. <laughs> no, leave him alone. It was his first. It's fine. He's learning. So you're the only one with bad grades. <laughs> Alright, next question guys. I think this is the last question. Yes. So, never have I ever peed my pants. Peed my pants? Does the wet the bed count? I was, I don't know. Uh, I did pee once when I was like. Guys, 
I was the worst bedwetter. I was a bedwetter. Were you really? I was. I was a bedwetter <laughs> too. I was. I, Lord, I'm so embarrassed. I used to wet the bed so bad, and sometimes I'd be having a dream <laughs> that I was on the toilet, and that was that's what made me wet the bed. So God has to be really cold, and I didn't want to get up, and I was so comfy and cozy. So I wet the bed before. Baby didn't know that. Now you know. I know where the bed now. So, uh, um, guys, I'm happy because, um, when we were at home, you know what? I cleaned my bed. And then we just had to get all this stuff out, like, all different stuff on my bed. Yeah. You peed, yeah, like two weeks ago, you peed. Yeah. Oh, we, we, that actually was like a week ago, you peed the bed. It's okay. And then he started to play it off in the morning. He was like, Dad, I think my, I think there's like a wet spot on my bed. Show the face, my <laughs> That was the face. All right, guys. So this was fun. You guys got to learn a little bit of stuff about. This was fun. Did y'all have fun? Okay. Did y'all have fun? I'm gonna make one, okay? Okay. 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 Never have I ever crashed into a window. Oh man, that was a good one. Did you crash into a window so Kelly? Oh, you did run into that. You ran. Did you did you do? And at home, you ran straight through the window. <laughs> yeah. I like that. That was a good one. So, guys, I'll tell you. So, once uh, uh, Daddy opened the door, and then. Uh, the screen wasn't open, but the door was open. So, yeah. the screen door was closed, but the yeah. door was open. And then I thought I couldn't see the screen door, so I went running, and then my whole body was compelled. He bounced off the screen and flew back, and he was looking like. <laughs> Yo, and then my butt fell onto the ground. Oh, he said his whole body went kapow. Oh, we got a chance to learn a lot about each other. This was pretty good, you guys. Hey. And to learn that we were nasty kids too. We used to pick our boogers. Hey. Why well, did? He makes you can make But that's not just pick them. You used to eat them. Oh yeah. Boy. Hey, let me ask y'all a question. Uh, did y'all have fun? Did y'all fun doing this? I had fun doing this. Hey y'all listen, this is our first Never Have I Ever Challenge, so I want y'all to comment below and let us know if y'all enjoyed it and if y'all want to see a part two. Ooh, and if the part two, it could just see, let us know if y'all want to see just the kids, all of us again, or Justin and I will Never Have I Ever, but we really get, get down and get to those questions, so we're happy you guys tuned in. What do they need to do, guys? We're gonna get back to your singing, okay? But right now, Fisher Fan, we, we out! out.